the Collier County Supervisor of Elections Office will be asking permission to start opening mail-in ballots today. If they get approval, the office says it will likely be the earliest it's ever been allowed to start counting ballots, and it all has to do with the increase in mailing voting we're seeing right now because of COVID-19. Our Jessica Alpern talked with the Supervisor of Elections in Collier County about this. She's live with more. Jessica, what did the Supervisor tell you? Well, that request to start opening today will actually follow a meeting that's set to take place right here at the Collier Supervisor of Elections headquarters at 10 a.m. So first, they'll be running what they call a logic and accuracy test. This is a public meeting that's held to show their machines are working correctly. If all goes well, they'll then ask the canvassing board for permission. That includes the Supervisor of Elections, Chief County Commissioner, and Chief Judge. If they get that approval to start opening and preparing ballots to be tabulated today, they then anticipate the tabulation process would begin early to mid next week. The office tells me it believes this will mark the earliest it has ever been allowed to do so. And they have this flexibility from the governor's executive order due to the pandemic and the surge expected when it comes to mail in voting. The office tells me it sent the most ballots this year than ever before in Collier County. We sent out over 108,000 uh, ballots to voters and that just increases every day. And to give you some perspective, go ahead and take a look at your screen. It says in 2016, it had more than 67,000 requests of that more than 57,000 voted by mail. So far of the more than 108,000 requested for the 2020 general election, more than 8,000 have been cast by mail. So with that surge, there are also questions surrounding election security. This is something we touched on yesterday in Lee County. We're also going to let you hear more from the supervisor of elections office here in Collier County on the matter coming up in our next half hour. For now, reporting live in Naples, Jessica Alpern, Fox 4 in your corner. Thank you, Jessica.